think the biggest takeaway is talk to your children. Yeah, they do listen. Jessica Egger is thankful her daughter listened to all of her safety advice over the years. She says last Friday her daughter was driving home from the Clay County Fair when she got this strange alert on her phone. Well, as she was driving from the fair to um, a safe place because she had called me to talk to me about the pen. I said, you know, drive to a safe place. Egger says instead of her daughter going back to campus at University of North Florida, where she lives and goes to school, she went to a nearby movie theater to get out and look around the car. She had her friend call 911 uh, while they were driving because she stayed on the phone with me. Uh, the police, JSO, they were wonderful. They came out, they took a look at, at her vehicle. They you know, they didn't find anything either. The alerts on the phone say unknown accessory detected near you. And Edgar says it shows her daughter's route to the movie theater. First Coast News spoke with the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office about the alerts. With all of these electronic advancements that are coming in society today, also comes the risk of, of criminal activity. There's the risk of criminal activity with air tags, but JSO says there's also the harmless chance that someone is just in your area with an Apple Bluetooth device. If somebody gets a ping notifying them that an air tag has been detected, if they feel that they're being tracked or that they're a victim, then absolutely they need to call us. As for Egger, she and her daughter filed a police report to document the potential device, but she says there are still a lot of questions that need answers. Not knowing is, is almost worse, you know, because you, you don't know someone's still out there. Destiny McKeever, First Coast News, on your side.